Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and to another reaction video. All right, so I'm pretty excited for this one. Today we're going to be checking out the trailer for Aki, the upcoming DLC fighter for Street Fighter VI. Um, so we've been waiting quite a while to actually get a glimpse of what her gameplay is like. They gave us a little teaser of her before, you know, we got to see, uh, uh, like a, a cutscene, like a little video interaction of hers where we could see that she's pretty crazy. Um, and of course, we've known her design for quite a while. So I've been really excited to see what this character can do. I'm kind of hoping that she has some more ranged gameplay, maybe some zoning options, because if you know me, you know I'm a fan of that type of gameplay. And uh, the female characters so far in Street Fighter VI, there's nobody that really has any sort of zoning, so hmm. Chun is really the only one, but she's not like a zoner per se, but yeah. So just quickly before I get into this, sorry if my face is a little bit shiny and <laughs> red. Uh, I actually just got out of the shower, so I just washed my face and I don't want to put all my makeup back on. So we just got some lipstick and we're going to be a little shiny. So anyway, um, I'm really excited to get into this. Hope you guys are excited to check her out too. Here we go. <clears throat> time to work, time to work. Ooh. When inhaled, Korea Merton blocks the gamma amino butyric acid receptors in the center. Alright, here's all the crazy poison oh, talk. Like we saw this. <laughs> it's a work of art! It's this is what she was like before. What to do with you now? <laughs> so Shall we put him out of his misery? She's definitely insane. <laughs> definitely insane. Ooh. Oh, 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 oh. She's got... Okay, range for sure. The, the slashing moves. Okay. And it looked like some dog damage stuff. Like, so... Fail? Are these come Ooh! Ooh, that's like a whip a whip of like her poison. What is she just what? What? What is she doing? She's sliding under everything. What is she is that a command grab? That's gotta be a command grab, right? Like what the She's like a spider! Oh, oh, that was a really fast slide and a slide. Right through him! This outfit's crazy too, this must be outfit two. Oh, oh, what was that? Poison like it. Yes, there's a projectile. Yes, yes. I really like the song too. Okay, so she's definitely, uh, like, somehow they managed to make a female character that was supposed to be uh, both kind of attractive, but also literally insane, to a greater degree than Jury, which is <laughs> impressive, because I never expected to see that happen. Um, I'm really excited after seeing this, I'm going to be honest. So I, I, there was definitely some, like, uh, usage of projectiles but not, like, that clearly wasn't the centerpiece of her gameplay. Um, so she's not a zoner per se, but she does have some. And she does have, like, like those whip sort of moves with her purple poison, I suppose, have, have quite some range. So I wonder if she's got, like, so... She's got some... You could think of her more as, like, a, a range character that's not technically a zoner, but has some of those options, kind of like poison in Street Fighter V. Uh, poison, haha. Uh -huh. Um, and then of course she has the poison moves, which I'm assuming, like, with Fang, because Fang was her master, uh, does, like, dot damage, uh, over time, which would be cool, but there's way more going on than this, because she has the claws, everyone was wondering about the claws being kind of, like, Vega slash moves, and you definitely get that vibe in certain instances, and they stretch out pretty far, so, like, 
early on in the beginning of this trailer, they're showing her, and she's at quite a distance from Chun Li, and the the claws basically stretch out from there. So, uh, we also saw some crazy, like she contorts all over the place. So it's going to be maybe a little bit confusing to figure out exactly what she's doing as the opponent. On top of that, okay, on top of that, I saw some crazy sliding stuff. Like, there was one section in this trailer where she was just sliding backwards across the floor, like, for far longer than I would have imagined possible. Um, and I kind of, so I like how they ended this with her against JP, because I'm curious if they're trying to suggest, after, like, a lot of people have been concerned about JP, again recently you know he went through like a phase of people thought he was broken and then people thought he wasn't as good as they originally thought and now people think he's kind of broken again <laughs> so i wonder if they're kind of trying to be like hey this character could be counter uh to jp in some ways which would be interesting um i also really love her design now i'm looking at so they showed us her outfits one and two outfit two is pretty cute it's pretty cute, I'm not gonna lie, but I I like outfit one. I'm really into outfit one. But yeah, I think she looks fantastic. Um, the stage she's on at one section is, I think, is just the same stage that we already had, right? I'm trying to go back and look. Yeah, I think they just showed stages we already had. But her song is really cool. So... Yeah, I'm really excited. I'm very, very excited to get to try her out. Uh, been waiting for this character for a while, so. All right, I'm going to wrap this up, guys, so I can edit it and get this posted. But I'd like to hear your thoughts. What do you think about her? Are you going to try her out? Are you worried about playing against her? What do you think? Do you think she'll be good against JP? All right. Thank you guys so much for joining me, and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye.